Okay, we're back to streaming. Um, I'm going to keep talking for as long as possible to see if this is... Oh. oh, no. It's coming through my laptop now. I'm going to read that quickly. Okay, yeah. There we go. I don't know what caused that. Um, yeah. Everything on OBS looked fine. Like, uh, wasn't muted. Uh, was through the right source. Um, but yeah, you were right. When I checked on my laptop, it, I, there was no audio coming through. I don't know exactly what caused that. Restarting OBS seemed to fix it. I don't know when that cut out. Sorry about that. Um, that's really strange to look, because I was even talking to someone before. The game did crash at one point because... Uh, well, it didn't crash, but restarted because I dropped out of connection. Maybe that affected it? I don't know. Either way. Sorry about that. Thank you for letting me know. Um, I hope that you haven't been listening to me in silence for too long. Um, Alrighty. How you doing, Kit Carnage? Uh, Tom straps Jerry to a rocket projectile rocket to be... S oh, that's why I was curving. Okay. If Jerry is not with Tom, then Tom launches a rocket that locks onto Jerry. Okay. Uh, fishing the projectile will stay out until you release the input with little hits of Emmy while it's travelling. Uh, oh, it hits it when it reels it. Okay, so you can time it that way as well. And then the snap trap. Tom will place a mouse trap projectile on the ground. Any ally that runs over the... That would be useful. Uh, and a stick of dynamite that will explode on its second bounce or if it hits an enemy. Okay, so I gotta use the down special a bit more often. Um, kick counts, I just turned. Oh, thank goodness! <laughs> yeah, no. Um, yeah. Probably for the best, anyway, then, that you did just join. Um, but yeah, no, that's all good. Um, I had a bit of an issue earlier where the game just kind of completely dropped out because of the internet dropping out. Um, which is not fun. So, yeah, no. But, oh, well. It's fine. It's, it's fixed now. At least hopefully. Um, I hope you're having a good time. I hope you've had a good day. Um, yeah. Uh, is the music coming through okay on your end as well? Because I'm listening to like the Twitch approved music stuff. Um, I did test it earlier and it seemed to be working. But then again, I don't know whether the uh, internet dropout may have broken that as well. Um... <laughs> Oh, hello, Velma. Uh, ooh, oh, yeah, I've got a path now. Uh, okay, increased projectile speed. That doesn't really affect me that much except for the fishing rod, but I'll take it. Because um, I don't think anything... Ah, uh, might affect the, the fireworks, actually. The fireworks and the fishing rod. Otherwise, everything else is placed. So... Although Velma does a fair amount of projectiles from memory, like she does her like speech bubbles. Um, Prepare uh, yourself. I think it's pretty good. Um, in the state that's in, I'm actually kind of surprised it's not full release. Um, like there's some rough edges, um, but it's less bugs, but more so quality of life stuff. Like um, one thing I found the other day is that if you launch the game, because I'm playing it through Steam, even on the PS3, do these like, Momos really um, think they can beat us? If you launch it through Steam, big, uh, like the big picture, um, it has trouble recognizing the recognize your controller. Like it'll recognize it, but then whenever it goes through a loading screen, it resets, which is kind of annoying. Um, and another small thing I found is that if you, if you, if your internet connection struggles and it drops out, there's no quit button on the actual title screen, and it doesn't let you any further in than the title screen to join the game. So you can't actually quit the game unless you have an internet connection, unless you alt tab out, which is not great. Also, pay no heed to the connection problems I'm having with the game at the moment. I have not had an issue before to do that. Mainly because I am streaming both music, go, the stream itself, go, and playing the game. Match point. So I think that's more of my internet connection so than it is the game itself. The game itself is pretty good. Cool. Um, yeah. You know about what I'm doing, that's right. Um, but yeah, no, um, super hard to see over the action. Okay. Um, I might. Um, Okay, that's fine. They've won the match anyway. That's fine. I'm going to take that moment quickly to fix that up again. Uh, that's everything else. Oh, yeah, the audio is just skyrocketed up. I don't know why that is. Um, I'll pop a mic my mic at max, but it doesn't mean if I shout, it's going to pop the mic. So I'm going to... Uh, I'll bring it back down just in case on the mic, but I will bring down the game audio way down. Um, there we go. Much better. Good, 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 good. Um... 
Yeah, no, I think I brought it up early because it was way too quiet, and I think I just overcompensated. Sorry about that. Um, yes, sorry. Um, yeah, so the game is pretty good. Um, I, as I say, I'm surprised it's not full release. Like, the, the issues I've had so far have not been buggy issues. They've been quality of life stuff. So I was just saying that there's an issue where if you launch it in Steam Big Mode, it has trouble recognizing your controller. Um, if you don't have an internet connection, it doesn't let you pass the um, title screen, which is fine, but there's no quit button on the title screen. So if you're stuck without an internet connection and you've already launched the game, you can't actually quit the game unless you alt-tab. Not the worst thing in the world, but it's a little annoying. Um, and, like... Unlike something like, say, Elden Ring, which actually seemed to take a bit of an effort to close um, by alt-tabbing, this actually closes pretty quickly when you alt-tab, so it's not that much of an issue. It's just like, yeah, if you can fix it, you can fix it. Fix it. If not, eh. Um, the characters themselves are quite fun to play. Um, they're usually quite intuitive. Um, like, I, I think it's less that like characters are um, Balance. Well, I would say the closest that I've found to a character being somewhat unbalanced is maybe Finn. But I think that's mainly because people tend to spam an attack he's got where um, he goes into that weird... Because it's Finn from Adventure Time, so he like morphs into that weird dog shape that he can go to. Um, and if you touch him, even if you're attacking him, 90% of the time, even if you're attacking, it's you who gets hurt. But because it can last for so long... They tend to just run over the entire stage and repeat it. And you only get atta attack decay if you hit someone. Not if you're just spamming the attack. Uh, Miguel Harley. Yeah, I'm surprised to see that not many people are actually playing Harley. At least in the matches that I've played. I feel like I see a lot of Shaggy, Arya, Batman, Superman. Um, and there's a lot of Taz and Finns. But there's not a lot of Harleys, not a lot of Wonder Womans. Um... Not a lot of Tom and Jerry's, to be honest. Um, also, not a lot of Steven Universe love. Like, I don't watch Steven Universe myself, but I kind of like the character design. I haven't played them yet, but from what I've seen, they've kind of had interesting move, um, uh, move lists. So I'm surprised they don't get played more. Um, if I could just hit Harley with my own hammer. Uh, um, but you know, otherwise the game's pretty good. It... When I'm not having internet connection issues, um, it runs beautifully. Um, art style is fantastic. I feel like everyone... I was worried about how so many characters from different forms of media would mesh together. Like, especially Arya. Like, when you look at how Game of Thrones is made... Um, uh, yes, <laughs> it is OP. Um, oh, fuck, I'm going the wrong direction because I'm not paying enough attention. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, no, um... I feel like, because Arya is from, like, a, like, sort of, you know, like, a muted colour tone live-action show that's heavily stylized to be, like, sort of fantastical. I wasn't sure how well it was going to work, say, against Tom and Jerry. But no, it works. They've, they've got the art style pretty well done. Um, oh, I don't even remember um, getting Jerry out. That's fine. Oh, I'm not doing well in this game. Um, I think I'm reserved to not being very good during the stream, both as part of my own incompetence with this game, um, but also the connection issues kind of make it a bit janky, um, but it is mostly my own incompetence. Um, I'm having fun though, so I, oh, shit, that was a good one. That's I think my biggest issue with the game is that I keep, my fault, I wasn't looking. Um, I think the biggest issue I have with the game is that I haven't quite got used to the movement speed just yet. So I keep doing that thing where you stop where you think you're going to hit them, but you're that close, but that's far enough that it doesn't actually hit. Uh, which can get annoying, but I feel like the more I play this, the more I'm going to get used to that. And it also doesn't help that at the moment. I'm playing a new character, so I've got to get used to their, how they play at the moment. Um... I didn't get in time for a key, so I'm glad to see gameplay. Yeah, um, because it's alpha, I wouldn't be surprised if they maybe do, like, a network test or something when it gets to beta. Um, like, I keep on accidentally saying beta anyways, it is just because it feels polished enough as it is to be a full release. Like, I think the closest you see in-game to it at all being, like, an alpha test is that over Velma and Taz, you've literally got, like, this experimental 
like um, stamp on them. I actually hope they don't change Taz too much, because he's really fun to play. Um, like I fully leveled him up purely because I got hooked on his character. I think, I think one of his attacks is a little OP, but I would rather that they tone down the amount of damage it does rather than outright change his move set. Um, but you know, Velma. Velma is tricky to play, but she works. I think the main the main problems I have with her is just because of my own incompetence, not anything wrong with the design. Um, but yeah, no. Um, if if they do do an open beta or a network test or something in the future, I would highly recommend trying to grab a key. Um, but yeah, I suspect that you were trying because you say you didn't get in in time, so I assume that you didn't get in this time, even though you applied. So yeah. I'm really surprised they went with Taz. To my ancient but he feels the most out of current pop culture. I'm glad they did that. Yeah, I'm... I kind of agree. I'm surprised that they did a couple of these characters, to be honest. Um, like, Taz, I don't remember very well, but I have fond memories of sitting in, like, primary school, after school care, like, having, like, Looney Tunes, like, VHSs being popped in the player. Um... I don't remember that much of them. I must be. I must have mixed. My long term memory is shit to say the least. Um, but no, it's a it's a pleasant surprise to see you in there. And same with Tom and Jerry. Um, like Tom and Jerry is probably. I was saying earlier that I like I I didn't. He probably wasn't the character that I had the most amount of nostalgia on out of the entire roster. But I think out of the alpha roster, absolutely. Like I think out of the entire roster. I can't go past Iron Giant. Iron Giant is so good. I am so mad he's not part of the alpha, but I can understand why. Like, it's an alpha. Not everything's going to be here. But I think aside from Iron Giant, Tom and Jerry is definitely up there in terms of nostalgia for me. Like, um, I think one of my... Fun- Ooh. Um, he had his own short show on the morning cartoons in the nose or after. I can't recall properly. Um, I would imagine probably mornings because of the Saturday morning cartoon type vibe. Like, I remember... Oh, God, now I'm having memories of Toast TV. <laughs> I think that was on uh, what was what channel was it was it literally just called Channel Go I feel like I had a number associated with it I don't remember what the number was but I remember Toast TV on like um, I think it was on Go um, and yeah yeah I'm 36 I just have terrible memory yeah look I don't think age has anything to do with it like I'm 20 turning 21 in a couple of months and my long term memory is still shit <laughs> So you're you're all good, um, but yeah no um oh god now I'm just thinking of Toast TV and Saturday morning cartoons and Ben Ten and oh. I did see a leak I think recently that suggested it's a rumor, um not confirmed but I did see something saying that Ben Ten was gonna join the game which I'm excited for but I just know it's gonna be the reboot Ben Ten and I'm like. I, I never watched the reboot. I I was more of an original and um, Alien Force kid. So I really hope it's one of those versions. Or at least... Because um, some of these characters have skins. Like you would have seen when I hovered over Taz. He had like a weird sort of beach outfit on. I hope that if they do skins for Ben 10. Even if it's not the default skin. I hope that the original Ben 10 look. Um, or the Alien Force look is like a skin of his. That would be fun. That would be fun. Assuming he is going to be in the game. But we don't know if he will be or not. Um, it's only a room at the moment. Um, but you know, it, it, it's fun. It's I like what they've done. The roster is well balanced. There's a nice mix of characters. It's great seeing Sto- Scooby-Doo characters in there. Um, and yes, they've put in a bunch of the memes of Shaggy. But I'm more happy that they've actually just got them in there at all, to be honest. And made them work and not just shoehorn them. Like, it does look, feel like that they actually work. If anything, I feel like Velma's the most shoehorned of them, but I'm still happy that she's there. Um, I think I only said that she's shoehorned because her moveset is things like she throws pieces of evidence or like throws like um, speech bubbles or when she brings out a calculus and calculations come out to the side that can hit people. Like, it's kind of very contrived, although then again, what, what part of this game is it contrived? So I can't complain too much. Um, like, Tom and Jerry are working together, for God's sakes. <laughs> like, that, that hardly ever happens. Um, unless you're watching, like, one of the directed, like, DVD, like, films. Or, like, um, 
the films that they just air on Cartoon Network and not in cinemas type thing. Like, there was one where it was like they had like a rat race kind of thing, I think at one point. I think it's probably the most amount of nostalgia I have for these two characters, is that they had like a, a film that was all about them doing a race, and they were fighting against one another, I think. And like, there was a scene at one point where one of the other racers who was like, I want to... I know she was female, and I don't want to be stereotypical, but I want to say she was characterized as a, like a stay-at-home single mum, but I could be wrong. I could be showing some form of sexism there, <laughs> if that's not true. Um, but she was like driving a car and she accidentally drove it into like a quicksand pit. And I remember there being a skit about her like trying to call for help through like the 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 inbuilt um, screen in the car. Yeah, no. Um, my kid would love that. Ben 10 was his hyper fixation special interest years ago. It'd be fun to play for sure. Yeah, no. Like, I'm trying to think, what other, what other characters would work for this game? Because the trick is as well is that it's got to be limited to Warner Brothers. Which, to be fair, they own quite a lot. Not Disney a lot. But a lot as is. Um, just trying to think. What else would they own that would be good for this? And my mind, my mind is just coming up blank. Uh, shit. I initially went Steven Universe, but it's like, no, they're already in there. Like, well done, Asher. <laughs> it's just like, you're staying the obvious there. Um, oh, I tell you what I'm surprised that they haven't got in. Um, Martian Manhunter. He'd be perfect for this. Like, you've already got Taz, you've got Bugs Bunny. Chuck and Martian Manhunter. I would die if the Animaniacs came out. Yes! I... I've never been a big Animaniacs watcher myself, but I love the art style of that show. Um, and I have seen some skits from that on YouTube. Um, I think my brother and my sister would love that more than I would. Um, like, they're, they're a fair bit older than me, enough that they grew up watching Animaniacs. So I think they would get a big kick out of seeing Animaniacs. Um... I, w I wonder whether you'd make them separate characters or whether you'd make them almost like a Ice Climbers deal or slash Pokemon deal where it's like the three characters in the one because it's three siblings from memory isn't it? Um, do they have separate names or are they just known as the Animaniacs in general? Um, but I'd be interested to see how that would play because I haven't seen that much of the Ma uh, Animaniacs but I could totally see them working artistically. Um, my encouragement to actually go and see the show as well because they had like a reboot i think i am doing terribly tonight but that's fine i'm having fun uh just like but they had a reboot i think in was it 2020 um like and i they they even like made like a jurassic park like spoof on social media from memory that got a good laugh from me because i'm i'm a bit of a jurassic park fan not all the films are great in fact a fair amount of the films are Pretty shit. Dominion looks like it's gonna be terrible, but I'm gonna watch it anyway. <laughs> um, but you know, I'd be interested to see them. Yakko and Wacko were the boys. Okay. I'm surprised that was not me going off the side of the screen, eh? Um. Oh no, I'm a chicken. Um. <laughs> yeah, no. Um. Hey Google, what are the names of the Animaniacs? Hasn't been working all evening. I don't know what's stopped it from working. It's going to yell at me in a second and tell me to try again in a few seconds. Um, your teammate has ordered parties to settle. That's fair. Oh, wait, you can disable in the settings? I don't know if you can disable in the settings. I'm going to check that. I don't know if you could hear that, but that, that was it then going like, no, not working. Um, I don't know what's going on. It might also be related to connection issues. Um, that's a Nazi. What? I missed something. Was there like someone's username that was offensive or the Taz was a Nazi? Oh God. Well, if he was my teammate, I'm glad he didn't. Oh no, I can see in the background he was an enemy. Um, yeah, I'm glad he wasn't my teammate. Um, cause that's, yeah. Um, bit shit to say the least. Um, can I actually report him? Uh, I'm so sorry for my steam list. I 
I don't remember who that first person is on the Steam list. Uh, yeah, look, some of my friends do very coarse names. I like they're not the kind of names we were just talking about, thankfully. But I don't think. Yeah. Uh, how can I see who I was recently playing with? I know there is a way to do it. Online WB friends. That I've seen it a couple times where it shows you who you recently played with. I don't know how to get to it though. Is there a report function in the settings? Maybe online legal. There's the auto party thing. Um, Eula credits region. Uh, uh, how do I get back to the main? Can I? There we go. Shit. Yeah, I don't see a function there. Um. Uh. Does, oh God. I hate people like that who choose usernames like that because either A, the genuine Nazis, which is like, what the fuck? Or B, they're just trying to get a rise out of people with stuff that, like, look, I enjoy South Park, but I'm not a complete defender of South Park. Like, I've, I, if you asked me two years ago, I would have gone, hi, it's South Park, there's nothing wrong. And looking back, I'm like, no, they totally do some things wrong. Not everything is equal in terms of, like, how it's treated with humour. Um, and sometimes the way that you joke about stuff makes those things worse, not better. Um, so, yeah, it's either actual Nazis or shitty people in general. Um, I'm going to take a quick break from playing a match and actually see if I can jump on Warner Brothers' website and see if I can actually find a report function there, maybe. Because I find it stupid there's no report function in-game. Like, I already know there's no feedback button, because I already tried looking for one with, like, the title screen stuff, but I couldn't find one at all. Um, Warner Brothers, actually, if I go, if I Google Multiverses, I'll probably take them to the official site. Um, I wonder if they've got that infrastructure up, though, yet, or not, because it hasn't been released yet. Um, oh, God, it does look like date of birth. Uh, uh, if I go FAQ, maybe it might have something in there. No, probably the policy terms of use, ad choices... What's the game overview? There's a social media. That's kind of it. Maybe if I sign in, maybe. Actually, yeah, that would probably help signing in. Um, sign in with Google. Yep. On the upside, banging music at the moment. Um, there we go. Signed in. Account settings. Maybe it's under account. Privacy preferences. WB friends. Nothing's coming up in there. No. Nah. Shit. Is there a report? Really? Is there a report function? I don't get that. Um, I'm of the opinion that the ones who do it for a rise just use that as a cover. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if you're right on that, to be honest. I, yeah. I have met someone in person who I was initially friends with, but more and more he lent in that kind of humour. And at some point he did genuinely question whether he was joking or not. Um, and at one point he just started calling me gay slurs, at which point I'm like, nah, you can fuck off. Genuinely, you can fuck off. So, I haven't spoken to him in years and have no regrets about that. Um, who's that between Shaggy and Steven, by the way? Uh, ah, that. Um, yeah, um, I think they're an original character for the game. Because where they would normally have, like, you can see with Shaggy, he's got, like, Scooby-Doo written on the right-hand side there. For Rain Dog, it just has player first games, which is the developer. So I'd assume he's an original character made for the game. Maybe? Or maybe he's from another game that the devs have made? I don't know if they've made anything before, though. I haven't looked it up. They might have. Um, but, yeah, no. So, I wouldn't be surprised if, like... I don't know if there's going to be a campaign in the full game. There's certainly not at the moment in the alpha. But I wouldn't be surprised maybe if he's, like, a pivotal role in the campaign, maybe? If there is one? Otherwise, he might just be an original character. He is a nice and fluffy, like, rain dog, though. I like his design. Um... Uh, Bit cheesy to have the pulsing heart in the middle there, but he's a good dog. We, we could keep him. Um, yeah, adorable. Yes, he is adorable. Google says he's original. Okay, yeah, well, there you go. Um, see, no, he's a support, so he doesn't go towards my goals. Um, although I am going to swap it up from Tom and Jerry, because I've been playing him for a fair bit now. It's now past half past ten. Um, alrighty. Um, Kit, do you have a preference for character you want to see played? Is there a character you haven't seen any gameplay of that you're curious about at all? The only character I haven't unlocked yet is Garnet. 
Um, but if I get 2,000 coins, I will be able to play as her. Actually, is it her or them? Because Garnet is... Is Garnet one of the characters that's like the amalgamation of two different gems? Or is she a single gem? Oh, the single gem. Oh, the single Um, Yeah, I don't know. This is the first time I've seen the game, but to be honest, I'm only half paying attention because Jem's still dreaming. Okay, that's fair. Um, alrighty. Well, I'm going to stick with another uh, mage then. I think the only other mage is Bugs Bunny, so I'll go with him for now. Uh, I'll just stick with the original appearance. That's fine. Prepare for my death-defying exploits. I used to be obsessed with carrots when I was a kid. It was basically... All I ate, which is not healthy. Like, carrots are healthy, but not when you eat them 24 7. Um, thank goodness. Oh, I was about to say, thank goodness I've moved on to Keisha's farm, like this, and tolerant. Um, but yeah, no. Alrighty then, double guns. Um, cool, I guess. Uh, right then. There's a full star damage. Highest damage dealt, 543. That's a fuck ton. Okay, alrighty. Um, attacks dodged, 840. Yeah. So what is Jim streaming at the moment? I hope she is having a good time. Like he, I, I, he, she, they, them. I should just default to they, them. I hope they're having a good time, whatever they're playing. Say, dog, did you see a carrot around here? Uh, oh god, I did it again. I should have looked at his move set before I actually hit play on him. That's all right. I'll learn on the go. Oh, that's how they do the tunnel. Okay. Okay, but he has a set range of it. Okay. Good to know. Okay, so the heart is not really that useful, I don't think, unless they're really that close. Uh, what about the neutral? Oh, I see, so that just marks the spot for the safe, okay. Yeah, we might have a chance at this. I say that as I accidentally eat myself off the side. It's fine. Oh, yeah. I keep on thinking it's gonna be like a ranged special when I do the side of special. But it's not, it's just the usual heart. I'm feeling all like inspired and stuff now. Game on! Maybe I just like re-roll the mage class stuff and stick characters on that. <laughs> that doesn't seem to be working. Oh, hello! Hello, G! Thank you for raiding, I didn't notice that until just now. I hope that wasn't too long ago. Um, I hope you're having a good night. Hello, Dolphin Pants, good to see you. Um, I hope you've all been having a good night so far, or day if you're watching from not the east coast of Australia. Um, yeah. Uh, thank you for reading. Hope your stream was good. Hope you had fun with whatever you were playing. Um, 
It's a bit of a privilege to be raided. I'm not sure if I've been raided before. I'm quite happy with this. Um, oh! Oh, the Alpha Taz is next reward. Okay, sweet. Okay, we're so close to the Alpha Taz. Alpha Taz, Alpha Taz, Alpha Taz. Um, cool. It was literally two seconds before you noticed. <laughs> okay, well that was lucky, because a lot of that I was just like... That was the first match I've actually focused in for a while, but I'm ter- I will apologize in advance. I am terrible at this game, but I have fun anyway. Um, does anyone have any kind of preference of what character I play? Because I, like I said, I'm terrible at this game. I, I don't have a particular preference as to what character I play. Um, and then the battle pass level after Taz gets the exclusive alpha battle. I know. I'm excited. I, when I first started doing this, I thought, oh, I've started the alpha a little bit late, like by a couple of days. I'm not sure if I'm going to reach that. And now today I'm just like, I'm so close. I gotta get it. <laughs> it's just like, um, yeah. So how are we all doing? How are you guys doing? Uh, I might actually quickly re-roll that one because I've been t doing two alpha mage classes. Be the first one to... Oh, that that feels like a bit of a cheaty one because I can just spam that at the beginning. That's all right. I mean, highly in Aria, but whoever you work best at. Um, I'll go Taz then because I've been wanting to have a bit of a Taz ran soon, and I feel like he's the one I've practiced most with. Um, so yeah, no, and as much as I don't have that much the style different, like I have a fair bit. Like I was just talking to Kit a while ago. Um about how I've got fond memories of, like, being at, like, after school care in primary school and, like, watching VHSs of Looney Tunes. Um, he's the one I've played most so far, which is nice. I'm annoyed that nothing besides Alpha Taz and Banner will transfer... Is nothing else transferring over? Is that true? Oh, don't tell me that's true. Because at the end of the, um, the battle pass, you've got the Samurai Batman... Does that mean, like, anyone who gets Samurai Batman, like, doesn't keep that? Like, I get some things might be changed in the full game that you can't transfer, but, but nothing else? Really? Oh. That hits hard. <laughs> like, alright. I'm surprised anything is since it's never... Yeah, that's fair. That's fair, Kit. That's fair. Um... Ooh, what's happened to all my pecs? Uh, yeah. yeah. I'll go for that one more. So I need to train Taz with more um, perks, but that's all right. Um, yeah, I suppose that is fair. I, yeah, I don't know. It feels weird, though, to promise some, but not... Although it's better than nothing. It's better to promise something than nothing at all. So I'll take it. Like, it's not unfair of them. And it, like, it, it's completely fair of them. It makes sense. But, oh. So how, how did you find that out, Dolphin Pants? Because I, I don't remember seeing that Prepare anywhere. Yourself. I know, right? I've grinded, I've grinded for days trying for Task Force X, Harley. And now I'm like, why even bother? Yeah. Yeah. I, I was at the beginning of the stream, like, for a solid hour playing Shaggy purely to get, like, his announcer voice. But now I'm like, do I even bother in my spare time trying to unlock that? Because if I don't keep that, why try to unlock that for now if I could just work towards the alpha banner? Ah, no, why? Haha, I out I, 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 you? I out tornadoed you? Oh, I can't speak tonight. That's fine. Alright, I gotta try not to spam, because that's a bad habit of mine, and it just means there's more attack decay. Um... No! No! Don't! Why? No! Yeah. Uh... Ooh, that was an... Ooh! That was a nice group hit, if I do say so myself. Oh! Oh! No, I wanna pick it up. What does that do? Maybe I need to hit something with it. There we go. Oh, I see. It's a nice block. Okay, that makes sense. Oh. Not sure what happened there. If I can just get the other Taz and knock him out, I can get my points back. Or he can do the same to me. <laughs> That's fine. I would love it if, because they've already got, like, the, um, oh, what's it called? Um, 
the weird beam that Darkseed has as like a cosmetic thing for knockouts as well as the Shazam thing. It'd be interesting to see if they add those characters into the roster. Jake, come here! Oh, what? I went over him with the tornado! There we are. I'll take it. Also, take any, um, like, jankiness you see with a pinch of salt. My internet connection, um, is not the greatest between... That was my own fault. Um, is not the greatest between streaming the game, playing an online game, and streaming the Twitch music at the same time. So, any jankiness you see is more to do with my own internet connection, not the game's servers. And like Dolphin Pants, um, you playing the game, you, you will probably see what I mean, that when you've got a good connection from your own end, the servers are pretty good. I haven't had an issue when I haven't been streaming. Um, a Twitter post from the devs who said everything in open beta in July will transfer. Okay, well that's something at least. Um, I hope so. There was a character leak that they found voice lines relating to, but I don't want to spoil. Um... Yeah, maybe not spoil it in chat now that there's more people. I was speaking earlier about one of the leaks I heard about, but in case no one else wants to hear about that, I won't say about I won't talk about it again. But there are some exciting leaks if they are true. Some leaks and rumors that I'm like, yes. I wish we could play Iron Giant at the moment. But I can understand why he's not in the game yet, because it is an alpha. Um but he is easily the character that's currently announced that I'm the most nostalgic for. Like, I have very proudly got that film on Blu-ray. I will never trade that film for anything. Um, I do find it hilarious that he's in a fighting game when his whole film was about, like, peace, y'all. <laughs> it's just, like, it's fun, though. It works. Um, alrighty. Uh, oh, I didn't use an emote. I gotta remember to use an emote. I can't remember to use it either. Um, uh, firm four inches. Was that one of the, I take it that was one of the plan names <laughs> again. Um, I re I'm really curious how size for Iron Giant will work. He will be support for sure. Oh wait, he's... Yeah, I was going to say, I'm not sure he would work as a support. Because he is literally like a war machine. Uh, I mean, I suppose he could be moral support. I mean, that was kind of his character in the film. So yeah, maybe. Um, but yes, I'd be interested to see how size works, because all the characters feel like they've been roughly made to, like, be... Like, Taz is a little shorter than, like, well, a, little, a lot shorter than everyone else, whereas everyone else, aside from Taz, seems to be roughly the same height. So I'd be interested to see whether they make... Like, they differentiate Iron Giant by making him a little bit taller than everyone, similar to how they made Taz a little bit shorter than everyone else. Or if they do, just go, no, nah, everyone who isn't Taz, you have to be this high to ride the... the that sounded like I was asking you to be high on drugs. <laughs> you gotta be this high to ride the ride. Um, no, you gotta be this tall to ride the ride. Um, increased damage to... Yep, yeah, no. Uh, uh, let's jump... Uh, actually, no. I'll change that because I feel like the tornado hits people upwards quite a fair bit. Um, yeah, no. Um, so I'm excited to play Iron Giant. Uh, in the full release. That'll be fun. That'll be good times. Um, Prepare yourself. I'm not sold on some of the skins that they've got for the Looney Tunes, to be honest. Um, even the one for Shaggy. The one for Shaggy just feels like it's... I don't know whether it references anything from the show, but it feels like the alternate skin for Shaggy, like his... Um, it, it feels like just another version of Bugs Bunny's like, bourgeoisie like, thing. It's just a purple suit instead of a purple dressing gown. Um, Shagsworth, I think the skin's name is. So it might very well be a reference to a character, but... Oh, I didn't do an emote. There we go. Emote's done. I don't remember if it had to be at the beginning of the match, or whether you just had to be the first one to do it. So we'll see whether they actually carried across into the um, daily missions later on. That's all right. Oh, I missed it. That's right. No! That was unlucky. Oh, my God's sakes, bugs. Get you. Ah, no. 
I was gonna do a dance slam, but um, I didn't anticipate it looking. That's alright. Oh, if I can just get Superman. If I can just get Superman. Uh, or he can get me, that's fine. That's fine, Harley got him instead. That's fine, I can look at that. It's a win for the team. I got <laughs> uh, I'm terrible at this game, but I still love it. It's great. Underneath him, I could have gotten him. Damn it. Oh, oh, oh! Yes! Got him! Haha! <laughs> oh! Okay, Superman, I gotta focus on Superman because now he's. He's got the highest damage. Oh no, now I'm just giving him match point. That's not great. Oh! Oh! Now we're all on match point! Yes! Sweet! Okay, this is good! Oh, but then Harley's at 98. No. No! Superman, leave me! Leave me! What's up, Doc? It's actually really close this round. Um... No. Oh, that was a good effort, though. I'm happy with that. That was a good effort. You really should try being a hero sometime, Quinn. Continue. Quinn, who's? Oh, he's talking to Harley. Uh, yeah, rematch. Why not? Both the quests popped. Sweet. Oh, we're almost already there. Uh, yeah, we'll go Taz again. So, ring out a player from. Oh! Temp 353. Disconnect. Okay then. Alrighty. Um, oh god. I already re rolled that one. Why? No! Oh god. God, but I'm all I'm terrible with both of the mage characters. Maybe I just don't worry about quests. Right. Is that an option? Do I just not worry about quests? Right. Um, we're gonna play from the bottom of the map. I doubt I can do that with the connection issues at the moment. Um, tank class. Tank class is more doable. Let's play a tank. Choose your character. Tank characters. Bruiser, assassin, assassin, bruiser. Support mage, mage, bruiser. Okay, so it's Superman, Wonder Woman. I thought Wonder Woman was support for some reason. Um, I will go for Superman then. What's his move set? Move set, not move set. Uh, charge an armored forward punch. Super rapid punches. Charge an armored hammer. Swing upwards. Uh. Okay, so that's all fairly standard. Um, neutral's ice breath. Okay. Charge ever ridicule on release. Superman will dash that location with a power, power, bleh, 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 bleh. powerful armored punch. Uh, Ten times tackles. Superman will fly forward. Charge to increase distance of flight. If he collides with an enemy while flying, he will grab them, break armor, and fly a short distance before punching them forward. Okay, so that's how you grab them in the air, which is like side special. Up special, meteor lift off, launch to the air, and come hurtling back to the ground with another powerful attack on start. Superman will have armor. Okay. Uh, Superman lunges upward, grabbing the enemy, breaking armor. Okay, yeah, alrighty. Uh, Superman receives 
armor and uses laser vision. The laser projectiles travel until they hit the ground. Uh, it's supposed to ground without armor. So man can dodge upward and diagonally upward from the ground. Okay. Wait, other characters can't do that? Oh, okay. Should you fall? I'll catch you. Hey. Sorry, man. I didn't mean to ignore you. Oh, you're all good. Cool. I, I saw the passive aggressive slightly scary sign. <laughs> I, I didn't mean it to be passive aggressive. I was just like, okay, quick, quick, can I use to like, to know, like, I'm streaming. So I was like, alright, um, coat hanger, paper, like, pit it, <laughs> like, stab, write it on there, Let's put it by the chair. More of a stab the paper through the coat hanger as well. Okay. Like, I wasn't sure how else to attach it to something and it, like. It did its job, it caught my attention. Cool, yeah. Sorry if I scared you at all. Which is lucky, because, wait, are you, are you still alive? Yeah, I'm still alive. You're not, you're not on camera though. The camera's aimed like this way. Yeah. Okay. I have no idea it's a game I want to play involved online. I don't think it does. Do it does, but not with me. Um, to be honest, it won't bother me that much because I've already been streaming for almost two hours. My connection is not that great anyway, as is. So I'm almost thinking of like stopping soonish. Um, so if you want to play a game, go for it. Quick question: Question: Are you starting a new game of Stardew? Oh shit, the game started. Um, because I was gonna say, if you're starting a new game with Stardew, um, I'd happily play multiplayer. Um, but if, if it, you're playing an established game, I don't think you can... You might be able to play multiplayer with an established game, but I'd have to look it up. Um, by the way, don't stress, if you want to play a game, yeah, go for it. Even if it's connection, like, needs a connection, don't stress. Because I'm probably gonna pack up soon, because my connection is not that great for the game. Anyway, and I think that's less because of anything else that someone else is doing, but more so because A, I'm playing an online game, B, I'm streaming it, and then C, I'm streaming the Twitch approved music. So. Yes. Go for it. What's up? Yes, the book. Thank you. Um, yeah, I think, I think we've still got like the triple buttered popcorn in the cupboard from when I bought it. Um, hot chocolate wise. You might still have the Neapolitan stuff in the cupboard, I think. If if you want to try the Neapolitan stuff, go for it. Um, like it is Capri kind of like basic stuff. Um, but like, <laughs> but yeah, but you're you're more than welcome to try it. Um. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't curious about the, new, the the chili chocolate, but I think for now I'll stick with the apple. Thank you anyway. Yeah, that's all good. Um, you'll be happy to know actually. So I don't. You probably have noticed, given that you asked about hot chocolate, but um, I got light milk this morning. Oh, um, if you want, um. I actually don't know if they ended up giving me a receipt. Um, if there is a receipt, it should still be in the IGA bag that I think is on the table. Um, but, yeah, no. Only fix me up if you want to. Don't feel like you have to. Okay. Pardon? You're fine. You're allowed to talk to me whilst I'm streaming. It's fine. If anything, it gives me more reason to keep talking during the stream, which I need to do. So you're all good. The The only thing that I'm worried about is making sure that you're aware that I'm still streaming. Yes! It's good fun. Do you want to play again? There is actually Shaggy in this. Sadly, not. Please tell me that Skippy that bleeds is born Missed opportunity. 
Um, I wouldn't be surprised if maybe they're going to add him as a character at some point. So I don't know if they've announced the full roster, and there are characters that have been announced that aren't currently available. Like, I, I was just talking about earlier how... Ooh, well, nice. Um, how Iron Giant has been... Um, Iron Giant has been confirmed as a character, but you can't play as him as, at the moment. He's not part of the alpha. But he is confirmed to be a playable character. To which I'm like, gimme, 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 gimme. Yes! And that's a skin, that's not the default skin, but I love how they got a pirate scene, it's great! Um, I, it hadn't even clicked with me that they're spe specifically pirates, I just thought, oh yeah, cute little sailors. <laughs> um, yeah, no, no, you can't yeah. I, I wish there were more skins in the game, though. Like, like, usually, like I, I think at the moment, though, it's fair, because it's only alpha. Mm. I'm surprised they have any skins at all, to be honest. Um... The downside, though, is that I got told by someone apparently in the in the, in the chat that um, anything we unlock as part of the alpha doesn't carry over to the full game except for the alpha test of specific rewards. Before you continue on, if you yeah. can go back with... I can't go back I... in, sadly. Okay. The next time you see Shaggy and he's in his losing animations, mm -hmm. please confirm with me if he's either eating that sandwich or blowing his nose into it. Oh, he's blowing his nose into it. I know the animation you're talking about. He's blowing his nose into it. Dude. <laughs> yeah, it's not great. It's totally in character for Shaggy. But... Is it yes, the it is. loves his food. Come on. But when he's sad, he'll use anything. Good point. <laughs> like, like, this is a man who's jumped into a dog's arms before. As well as having a dog jump into his arms. Hell, actually, that's something. Um, one of uh, not his move, but another character he plays with Velma. Velma is in this as a playable character. Her like side special. Excuse me, had a bit of a hiccup there. Um, she runs across the street, the screen in a charge, and she has her arms out like this. And if she runs into uh, any opponents, they they automatically go into her arms, and she can throw them off the side. It's great. And, and, and it's a great little reference to how she's always carrying Shaggy every now and again. Or someone's carrying someone in that show. It's not just physically she's always carrying someone, she's always carrying the team. Yeah, oh yeah. Intelligently. Yes. If, if she... It, to represent it with a league match, she is like the person who seems to always support everyone and actually get the game moving. <laughs> like... She's a tank. Yeah. Yeah, she is! Which is kind of ironic, because here I think she's a support class. So, I don't mean your character. Mm -hmm. How do you know this? Pa pass the instructions. Let, 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 let me divine what the amount of time it should be. I, I, um, I, I, I can give you the one to eat charcoal. Uh, charcoal has its place in culture. Um, not in food. Not in food, no. Um... Look, I'm trying hard with the comedy today. It's working, but I usually don't try this hard. It works. Um, um, no, I mean, genuine. Like, I, I, I always somehow manage to burn popcorn in the microwave. Yeah, you're all good. Uh, what time do you normally do it for? Uh, two, two minutes? Two minutes, okay. Run through all the popcorn uh, and stop popping. And our microwave is fairly weak, isn't it, for memory? And the last sitting it's got his, uh, that can't be right. 600 watts conventional, it's 240, ah, oh, but then you got inverter and convection. Do we know what type of microwave we have? Like whether it's inverter or convection? We've got no idea, do we? No fucking clue. I'm going to be conservative because there are some things on here that go as low as like 1 minute 30. I would try 1 minute 30. And if, if you're still hearing it pop, when it hits like 10 seconds to go, add another 30 seconds. I apologize in advance. That's, you're all good. Does that sound fair? <laughs> yeah. I feel like it's conservative enough. Um, alrighty. I might play one more game of this. Um, oh yeah, did, you didn't say in the end. Um, did you want to play a game of this at all or not really? No. Okay. Um, I might play one more game of this. Because... I'm very close to having done this for... Because I started streaming at 9 o'clock. Actually, I have done it for two hours. Yes, it's almost 11. I could stop right here. Yeah, I might just stop right here. Because... Does your audience want to do stuff like 
Well, there's only two people watching. They, I, there was someone who was talking to me a while ago, Dolphin Pants. Um, I don't know if they're one of the two people who are still watching. Um, same with Kit Carnage. There's a person named Kit Carnage who is here, who I know through the back pocket Discord. Um, but again, I don't know if she's still here or not. But I think they're also watching and doing other stuff in the background. And I have been streaming for two hours. Yeah, they're not saying anything in chat. So I'm going to take those as a thing. They're probably... And that's no problem. But, like, they're probably half paying attention only to this and half paying attention to something else, doing their own thing. So... And I have been streaming for two hours. I think I'm done for the day. I, I did initially say on my schedule that I was going to stream this for three hours. But... I think between the connection issues, we're about to have food. And I'm about to have a drink. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, uh, put it in for another minute and a half. Uh, and again, if it keeps popping, put, add another 30 seconds. Uh, so, yeah. so, to my lovely audience, who I'm just, like, addressing as if they've not been in... in well, you haven't mentioned anything in chat, but I can see you're there, because I can see there's two people watching. Um, I'm going to say good night, good morning, good afternoon, whatever time it may be, wherever you are. Have a good one of it. Um, I am going to call it for tonight. I I don't know whether I'll actually stream this tomorrow. I might see how I go. Like, I'll probably see how I go because A, tonight was a close call whether I actually made it or not to actually stream because I got held up downstairs. Um, and then the internet connection is not been good. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I probably won't, I won't stream this tomorrow. Um, mainly because, yeah, like, internet connection whilst doing all of this is not great for the game itself. Um... And, um, what do you call it? What was I going to say? Uh, and yeah, I need to rethink my schedule for streaming because it appears that nine o'clock may not necessarily work like it used to. So I got to rethink about what times I choose to stream. So I've got to give a bit of a think for that, but I, I do plan on streaming more often. I promise the three month draft I've just had is not something I wish to continue. Um, I know I want to finish Half-Life VR on stream at some point when my foot is better and it hasn't got two fractures in it. Um, and I've got to find more games than just my normal PC that I want to... I'm probably going to find a bunch of games that I've played before and have never finished and want to restart and finish on stream. Like, I know one game I really badly want to play and finish is um, the Alice series from American McGee. And I did start it, but I never finished it. So maybe that's a game we'll do. We might do that. Um... But I will show you that later. Um, yeah, for now, I would just say 